really good experience. I think that was uh, we're partner. We're partner, Mr. Lita and uh, <laughs> Mrs. O. Mrs. O. <laughs> on one, one of the days that we were, they sent us out, and it's it's really it's it's I'm eye, eye opening. Like you know, uh, can you imagine putting you in the middle of you know it's a Muslim country, <coughs> so. When you when they drop you off on put you on, on that spot Bye. where you go, it's just basically you're you. Own. You're on your own, and uh, wherever you look, it's, it's Muslim. Yeah. I, at first, I was you know scared, but as uh, hours uh, time goes by, you know I realized that they're really a good people. Like, they're very good. Uh, uh, here, if you ask someone, they won't even ask. I stop on what they're doing. <laughs> you know, they just continue what they're doing. They probably answer, but you know, there. If you ask some someone, they'll they'll stop on what they're doing and they'll take you to the place that you need oh, to find. Wow. Nice. So they'll really take extra. Oh yeah, yeah. They're really like. Yeah. So it's really an eye opening because what we see on on the news, it's yeah. it's totally opposite of. of what you see there, and they're, they're they're very nice people, but it's it's still a poor country. So, you know, it's the same in the Philippines. You know, yeah. they have they don't have jeep, but they have public transportation, <coughs> and we did experience a lot of those <laughs> public, <Black rice. laughs> public transportation. But it's 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 an eye opening again because you know in the Philippines I used to do that, and but when as as soon as we get here. You know, we become so uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> a lot of devices, a lot of you know, we're just we're spoiled here basically Amen. over there in, in and and there there like I feel like when you share the word of God there, it's much easier than you share the word of yeah. God in the street yeah. here. Yeah. They, yeah. Over there, they're like they're open, you know, they they. Even though they won't accept it, they're still gonna listen to you. You know, the over here, you as soon as you say Jesus, they'll just you know you know they just reject you right away. Over there, the you you feel it that they won't accept it, but they will listen to you. They will still talk to you. They will still entertain you, and it's you know it's really an eye opening. And and the testimony of those workers, it's really like. It is, if I'm gonna look to myself, what I did, it, mine is just a tiny, tiny dust yeah. of what they're doing there. The sacrifices of the teachers, the uh, missionaries. missionaries, and those guys has you know their master degrees. Yeah. <laughs> they read different they different kind of different. books. You know, uh, they went to elite school, <coughs> but they take their kids, their wife, and you know they they <coughs> you know. They just do it, and, and they said they're re and they're waiting for someone to uh, how do you call that to uh, resistance. But there's no resistance, and they said because they want to feel the resistance of the people of the Muslim persecution. Persecution. They want to be persecuted. They look at me. I was like, what? You came here <laughs> because you you want someone to persecute you. But he said that's that's really the the heart, the calling that they they want. You know, they want to see that because if you, if if uh, they said if they if you are being persecuted, that means that that's the fulfillment of the word is happening. Mm -hmm. You know, so there's an impact. There's an impact, and I really you know appreciate what they're doing there, and you know it's just like you know I cry out you know to God like really to pray for them, to help their family, you know, to have uh, abundant blessings and and funds and because of what they're doing is is, is really is really like gonna you know uh, push forward the coming of the Lord. Amen. And 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 you know it's it's really really good and the prayer uh forty eight hours it's it's really helped me a lot too it, you know to to pray not not to think about myself, but to think about those countries that we're praying, and it's it's a, a little tough 
we can stop the kids, <laughs> you know, a lot of work, but that, that, yeah, <laughs> hard, but not that work, it's, it's nothing compared to what those guys are doing. Mm-hmm. That's why I can't even complain that I'm so tired, that I'm sick right now, that, you know, I can't, because those guys are doing it every day. I only did it for not even <laughs> two weeks, <laughs> a couple of days. Right. And they're, do, they're doing this every day, those workers, and the teacher, as soon as we left the the uh, hotel. hotel, there's another group of uh, Ethel coming yeah. in, mm-hmm. and there's another Ethel com- yeah. continuously, and the, 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 yeah. that's their life, just doing <laughs> teaching, and you know, yeah. it's 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 really an eye opening, and it's it's really, I really, I, the most important thing is my eyes is really open to 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 have a heart with the Muslim that you know that. I should no longer fear them mm-hmm. because they're they're people of God and their heart is it's yeah. much better. I'm, I'm compared to the Jew and the Muslim Muslim heart are this thing. <laughs> like if you go to a restaurant, <laughs> the Jews they it seems like they don't like what they're doing. But if you go to a Muslim restaurant, they're happy. They they talk to you. They entertain you. And and I just like you know. But you know, we have to pray for Jews so that they they all change. It, you know, they really need our prayer. Yeah, <laughs> they really really need our prayer. So, I just you know thank you, Pastor, for you know teaching us all the <laughs> equipping us before we go there. At least we're we're ready to to you know to do that battle on on the the, the area. And I thank thank you the you know, God for protecting my family, just guiding us. Ah. Um, Helping us on uh, to get through on all the things that we we need, and it's a very uh, very humble uh, experience. And I I really want to do it again. Yeah. Yes, we will.